Greetings, everyone. I've got a treat, <laughs> retreat. I have a treat to show you guys today. We got a, depends on what you wanna call it, park model, destination model, uh, retreat camper in today that is absolutely awesome. I cannot wait to show you the inside. Beautifully redone interior colors, loft space. This thing is awesome. This one is the 39 FLFT. And for those of you that aren't familiar with destination or park models, these are not meant to be towed down the road every weekend and taken to different places. People typically put these in spots where they're staying in a permanent campground or if you have like a lake house or something like that, you'd put it there. So without further ado, let's take a tour. As you see, you have a nice big powered awning on this side that does have LED lights. So you're gonna get a lot of shade. You have exterior speakers. You do have your sliding glass doors here. Do, do, do. Give you a little view from the front. This is the uh, bedroom up here. So you're gonna have a beautiful view here if you park yourself at the right place. Storage options. This is your under the bed storage that you have access to from the outside. So you see you've got plenty of space and those steps are for your uh, sliding glass door. Then over here we have an outside shower. We have our tank flush and we have our city water connection. <laughs> Coming around to the back. Okay, so there's the exterior. The interior is what I really want to show you guys. Let's go take a look. Since we're coming in the bedroom door entry, we're going to start there. Beautiful bedroom. And like I said, when I walked in, I just started immediately picturing the kind of view you could have right there. I mean, look at that. So you've got your big king size bed. You have a lot of cabinets and drawers over here. Lots and lots of storage space. A place to set your TV or whatever you wanted. More space under there. And then directly across from the bed, we have a closet and then more drawers down below. And then, of course, you have that under the bed storage that I showed you from outside. In addition to all that space, you do so also have a hanging closet over here that is washer dryer prepped. So when I talk about, you know, staying long term or basically having all your amenities that you have at home, but at your vacation spot, like it's perfect. You've got your washer dryer hookup, everything. And I uh, want to point out those colors I was talking about. You see, they've went really light color on your ceiling. With that cool wood grain look. And then they've added some darker textures in here to kind of balance it out with your mix of white. Absolutely beautiful. As we come out of the bedroom, this is so cool. We actually have two lofts in this. When we come up and we look over here to our right, we have a loft that I'm right at six feet and I'm sitting up in this. I've got a little bit of head space. You see we have an AC up here, but you've got two beds up here and then you've got a little place over there to set a TV or whatever you wanted. And then over here, we've got a little cubby as well as a cool little storage area. Such a cool area, but then check out directly across from it. This would definitely be for a smaller kid. Um, I cannot sit up on this side, but I do have room. Like I can sleep up here, but that overlooks your living room. You do have power over here. It's a cool space. I would have killed for a space like this when I was a kid. So let me squeeze back out of here. We'll go down and we'll head into the main living space. Okay, on our way to the main living space, we've got our bathroom. So we of course have our toilet. We have sink with storage below the sink. You also have a medicine cabinet with storage. A nice big neo angled shower. So you do have plenty of space in there. Uh, like I said, I'm right at six feet and I've got plenty of space. And then you see we have more cabinetry here in the bathroom. There's that sliding glass door. You do have blinds for that, but those are uh, tinted. 
So it's gonna take a little bit of that sunlight out for you and then check this out. Oh, before I go any further, this does actually have the central vac system. So see, you don't even have to take your broom and dustpan and all that stuff with you in this bad boy. You just hook up your hose, sweet, put the hose away, you're done. So now into your main living area, I think we'll go this way and work our way around. We have our freestanding dinette that actually has an extender you can lift up. So that's giving you extra walk path when you're not using it, but extra table space when you need it. You've got four chairs, plenty of space there for family game night or dinner, breakfast, whatever. A lot of windows in this. As you see, it's very light and airy. I don't have any of the power hooked up to it right now. Extremely tall ceilings. And they've carried that light color wood uh, throughout the entire thing. You have a ceiling fan up here. A uh, nice skylight in your kitchen, which is awesome. Again, letting more of that light in. We have our theater seats. These recline. They're very, very comfortable. Not that I tried them out a little while ago. You've got a little place to keep your remotes and stuff so you don't lose it. Cup holders. And then over here, we have our jackknife sofa. It's actually a really big, deep jack jackknife sofa. Very, very comfortable. On each side, we have nice nightstands, and those do have storage below them, as well as the actual surface itself. We have a whole bank of cabinets up here for additional storage. We, of course, have some speakers up in the ceiling, and there's our uh, second AC unit. We have the AC unit in the bedroom, and then you have the AC unit here. There's a little bit better view of the ceiling fan as well as some cool recessed light stuff up there. Directly across from your seating area, you have your electric fireplace. This is a big electric fireplace. Super nice early season, uh, late season camping. Take the chill out of the air. Very nice and comfortable, but you can also just turn the lights on for that for your ambiance. Then directly above that, we have our CD, DVD, Blu-ray player that will connect to your phone so you can actually play your music outside while you're sitting by the fire or just outside playing. Um, but that'll control your inside and your outside speakers and, like I said, play CDs and DVDs. Nice big TV, probably 50, 55-inch TV that is on a swivel so you can move that if you need to. And you do have some additional storage cabinets up above there. Our kitchen, our kitchen's really pretty. Like I said, they've went, uh, uh, they've done a really nice job with mix matching these light colors. It's not too light in here, but it's certainly not too dark in here. You've got the darker furniture with the darker countertops, but then you have this light wood grain floor, wide plank floor with that ceiling that I was showing you. You have a residential sized refrigerator that actually has a lot of space in it. You have your two drawer freezer, which I think is really handy because you can keep ice, all that kind of stuff in there. Plus you have room for frozen pizzas or whatever you want in there. A cool little wine rack up above, which I think is a nice little touch. Our freestanding island, as you see, has a lot of drawers and cabinets below it. So you have a ton of storage space down here, like a ton of storage space. And then our sink is an 80-20 stainless steel sink. And this is like a really big rounded sink. Love these covers that they put over the top of them. So this is actual prep space when you're not doing dishes or whatnot. Uh, but then you can take those off to dishes. Even comes with a little soap dispenser. And of course you have your detachable sprayer, which is very nice. Painting back around. Oh, I do want to go. Our price for this is $49,985. So you can see that. Cabinets up above your residential size stainless steel microwave. You have a two burner stainless steel stove here. Actually three burner, I'm sorry. You have three burners. Uh, and then your stove's actually a really nice size. Again, more cabinets for storage. Keep all your pots and pans. And you have this nice big pantry. Oh, I wanted to show you. There's a look from that loft that we were in earlier. So you've got this nice big pantry. You could fit a month's worth of food in here, depending on how big your family is, I suppose. And then last but certainly not least, you have like a little nook area here where you could put your Keurig or margarita maker or whatever you wanted. And yet another cabinet. So there you have it.
I hope you guys enjoyed. The, like I said, this is the tour of the Retreat 39FLFT. Extremely, extremely sharp. Let me know down below what you guys think of it with all of the sleeping space you have in this because uh, you've got two in the bedroom, two in the one loft, two in that loft, probably one or two there on the couch. Tons of sleeping space and very, very roomy uh, park model camper. Have a great day, guys.